Now Fleming's left hand rule. Fleming's left hand rule is used to find out the direction of the force on the current carrying conductor. Now the three things, the magnetic field, the current in the rod and the force on the rod, these three are mutually perpendicular to each other. These can be represented by holding the thumb and the first two fingers of your hand in such a way that they are mutually at right angle to each other. All these three are at right angle to each other. Then if thumb indicates the direction of motion, first field, first finger indicates the direction of external magnetic field, then second finger will indicate direction of conventional current. Now if the thumb and the first two fingers of the left hand are held at right angle to one another with the first finger pointing in the direction of field and second finger in the direction of current, then the thumb points in the direction of force or motion. Now let's take an example. These green lines indicate magnetic field and this purple line shows different directions of current through this field. And we have to investigate whether there will be a force acting on this conductor or no in these three cases, A, B and C. Let's take the first case. As I have told so many times that three quantities, field lines, current and force are mutually perpendicular to each other. So obviously, and we have studied all, already angle theta in terms of angle theta also, that if angle theta is zero, sine zero will be zero. So there will be no current, no force acting on the current, uh, current carrying conductor if current is flowing in the same direction in which there are, these are the magnetic field lines are going. So force will be zero here. In second case, as current is at right angle to the field line, so we will have maximum value of the force acting on the conductor as angle between I and B, the field lines, will be 90 degree. And so force, direction of force will be, according to Fleming's left hand rule, it will be into the plane of the paper. And in the third case, force will be down the page. 